to bring the last member of, of a forlorn court uh, oh, you know, to this event. So dramatic. Just one Taking more, up. one more punching down on the court of seafoam. And who started that rumor? Huh? Uh, oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it was me. <laughs> I like all of my shiny rumor. things. I feel, <laughs> you very, got the I feel very much like one of those birds that yeah. Brennan will name now that really enjoys sparkly Magpie. things. Magpie. Uh, magpies and also bowerbirds. There it is. Oh. I've you never take heard your of pick. Bird. Which one am I? Am I a magpie or a bowerbird? Bowerbirds like a lot of different textures and, and qualities of light. Then let's go magpie. <laughs> <laughs> the rumor erupts into a scandal that the Prince Apollo did call off the marriage because his dear friend and fellow member of the Court of Wonder, Rue, was so desperately in love with the Viscountess Grabalba <gasps> that they wanted to propose. And <sighs> so it's, it is a way to accommodate what people are already saying, which is that the Court of Wonder called it off, but to make it rather than a judgment on the goblin court, it is instead doubly shameful for both Prince Apollo to have called it off and to do so because Deloso de la Rue uh, was so desperately madly in love with the Viscountess. Nasty, nasty. Oh. <laughs> Hob is a part of the dissemination of that rumor? No. No, Hob is not. Coward. Hob has been. Coward. Coward. <laughs> Throwing a bomb out there and putting it in someone else's True. hand. <laughs> Amazing. Love it. Okay, Omar. <laughs> Hold on. How'd you do with that tear, baby boy? Is that? Bam! That's like a shark shark dorsal fan. It's like a Jaws kind of. You keep tearing half dome. It's amazing. Uh, number one. <laughs> number two. Everyone is sort of watching Lord Erebus with mm. bated breath. Oh, what's he gonna do? I don't know. Maybe I'll have sex with the princess. <laughs> <laughs> Love, it's love. Oh, wait, that's it's right. Love. <laughs> we only have love. five episodes left of this oh, wager. Tick tock, tick tock. Hey, I can, uh, please, I can fall in love in an episode. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Do we like some of the same shit? Okay, maybe. Maybe I love you. What a bleak <laughs> outlook on love. <laughs> this is so yeah. convenient. We're in our 30s. Yeah. 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 Written in it about a, uh, a mortal mother who warns her three children to not go out on like a thin veil night, lest uh, they be swept up by the workings of the Fae. And they go out regardless and find like a beautiful dark pony. And the moment they mount it, the pony breaks for the ocean and like throws itself into the sea and neighs and whinnies happily as the children are drowned. And this story of uh, a moment of uh, trickster glory between those of Seafoam and those that are goblin uh, is heralded and remembered by the Seafoam court. All letters written by Squawk from now on will be written in illusory script. Ooh. Anyone who they are not addressed to, uh, it's a, I'm thanking them for a book recommendation. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, perfect. Uh, Can I fabricate a fake squawk reading a book in our window? <laughs> uh, this, is, this, yes. this, this one's called The Green Hunter. You just come up with the cover, make okay, it cousin. green or so something. Mature, so mature. He's been reading a book the whole time. <laughs> Turn pages. Like the ever present tides, my desire and affection for you continues to rise, undeterred by any obstacle and aligned with the foundations of the cosmos. You've clipped the wings of my heart, <laughs> and it rests eternally in your cage. Oh. With love, Squawk. Oh. Oh. Be a great honor in providing me with a hands-on, rough and tumble <laughs> hunting lesson at sunrise each day. Of course, your continued discretion is greatly appreciated. Oh, oh. No. oh my God. I've recently learned that every heart needs its hind, and I'm happy to play the part. <laughs> Pleasurably, squat. <laughs> Pleasurably! Oh my god! Oh no, so oh messy. Uh, Did you speak this in jest, or were these words honest reflections of your earnest, though mistaken, understanding? 
The question of goblin honour shall always warrant my swiftest response. Ooh. Your humble servant, Captain KP Hall. You got, him, man. Oh, you got humble oh, servant, oh, man. Did you? Yeah. Oh my god. Cousin, you will not believe <laughs> who I just got over from. Hold on, I'm making you turn pages. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> A little peck pop every time you turn the page. Oh, good, good. I don't like a little bit of this like that. <laughs> yeah. What's a peck pop? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, oh pectorals. pectorals. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. You know, I'm always thinking of grandfather. So I thought maybe. Our Skype. Our Skype, yes. <laughs> there you are. Um, I just got the most fascinating letter from KP Hop. Yes. He seems to be rather upset. At the uh, <laughs> at my uh, misspeaking uh, during uh, the hedge maze event. He's upset. He's upset. Oh, you mean upset like disturbed, like ooh, a bee's in my skirts and I like it. No, or no. upset. <laughs> he signs it, your humble servant. <laughs> well, of course, because he is lowborn. Oh, oh my God! He knows Cousin, to whom he a speaks. Bird, you have teeth. <laughs> well, then call me a goose. I think those ones. Uh, and that's in illusory script again, but just reads as a book review. Book review. <laughs> or uh, yes. <laughs> you, a my thoughts on the Green Hunter. <laughs> Here's why. <laughs> it's it's baby. scathing. I, no. One star. Oh, no. The Lord Erebus's letterbox is absolutely <laughs> ruthless. Necessarily to Grandpa Dog a whole lot. Mm -hmm. I believe the only word that Grandpa Dog has uttered thus far is the word shit. <laughs> that sounds right. And very quietly. Yeah. Kill me. <laughs> <laughs> Enough of that, Grandpa Dog. <laughs> uh, he's stalking towards you. you have jerky. And you throw the jerky and he ignores it. Oh. Because he's got old man teeth oh, and he yeah. needs soft food. Pudding? Aww. Do I have pudding? <laughs> the pudding. pudding. <laughs> Not chocolate. Yeah. Oh, you're so cute. You're just so... Yours. I, I. Thanks. Yeah. This <laughs> <laughs> is. I was not expecting That's it all. to yeah. talk. <laughs> <laughs> I hate it. It's not good. It's not good when he no. chooses to do it. <laughs> You're really cool. Like, just like really cool. Like, do you know how cool you are? I, my, my eyes well up with tears. <laughs> oh. Oh. No, it's fine. No, just read the letter and I'm gonna go. <laughs> <laughs> I literally, you yell in that tone of voice, and I go. Why ah, did I salute them? Um. Uh, as you're kind of hauling ass across uh, this tidal island yep. to get there. I think the new from the corner of grass is just sprinting. I don't... How lovely. <laughs> she seems really nice. Yes. And fit. Yes. Dear Lady Turp Featherfowl, do you have a map? Because I often get lost. There's no punctuation. <laughs> <laughs> Cousin. <laughs> I think Pillar Boy thinks he's stringing me along. I mean, what the kind thing to do is to let to... him think that I'm deeply in love with him. Nothing's no. All I'm... right, I write him back a letter and say, <laughs> Dear Sandhira, your letter finds me wanting. <laughs> oh my God. Not for your words, but for your presence. This is good. This is good, cousin. This However, is good. it is in lack that my passion grows. <laughs> please, please keep teasing me with your absence. <laughs> <laughs> and know that in your withholding, I yearn deeper and fierier and with more passion. Sincerely, Lady Featherfowl. The sexiest way to tell someone, stay away yeah. from me. Yeah. Stay yeah. the fuck yeah. away from oh, me. <laughs> it reads to me, I think advisor hears the yeah. book review or <laughs> the recommendation. That's exactly what happens. Like, what's the green hunt? <laughs> <laughs> I think I saw that in the library. Okay. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, I might have made it worse. What are you talking I about? I have no idea what I'm doing, advisor. I think I'm in it deep. I think Lady Trip's in love with me. <laughs> you, oh, boy. You have to tell me how you got there from a fairly scathing review. <laughs> this specific letter says that the longer I stay away, the more she burns for me. I have to seek her out and to let her know. Can I see your letter? <laughs> Would you like to see the letter? I would love to. I turn the letter over. Yeah. 
that's not what that says. <laughs> no, you think that because of the magic. You think it's a book report or a book review. Report. It's not. <laughs> Over the summer, I read The Green Hunter. <laughs> Squawk wrote the green, the green Hunter under a pen name. <laughs> It's my oh. book. This is oh, also actually, a ploy to get the sales to spike. Oh, yes. you know it. So I will start a rumor that the green that the green hunt is getting turned into a movie. <laughs> and it's gonna be fun. Have you seen the New York Times? They're adapting the Green Hunter. And in case you're wondering, my uh, pen name is Airy Perry. So. It's <laughs> how do you spell? How do you spell that? A A I R R Y. Yes. P. E A R R Y. <laughs> Not very <laughs> like a fruit. Okay. Here within the cacophony, your grandfather's voice as he speaks out through the chorus of birdsong. I plan on joining you for the climax of the bloom. I want very much to be there in person to give my blessing to the matches you have oh, sought fuck. out. <laughs> Tears oh, just God. running down my face, <laughs> running down my face. <laughs> well, yeah, well, yes, I mean, everyone's talking about this. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, hospitable, you're yeah, yes, oh, oh, so oh. yes, yes, yes. Um, oh. Oh. He said he's coming at the climax. Yes. So that would mean, because, I mean, Most technically- people do. <laughs> <laughs> Run over to whatever the like fucked up like ninety page like like Rubik's cube of a calendar the they have and be yes. like uh, you turn a page and like three butterflies come out and you turn another page and you smell like your mother's favorite food. I don't think we have a lot of time. I won't lie, I'm already engaged. So you, what? Well, it's not. A, uh, what? Uh, what? But yes, I'm already engaged to the Baroness Alvin of the Courtesy Fall. What? Uh, well, what? It, she was courting me very like, mm, she, we, she was courting me uh, previous to the bloom. I, I was like, oh, we'll go into the bloom. It'll be nice to already have one in the pocket. And so it's like, when we get to the end, it'll be like, aha, uh -huh, there we go. And I, me and you, we get to have all the fun we wanted. But then grandfather came down with all of this, and you have to be married. And, and, I, it's, I, and I don't know, I'm feeling very constrained. And you know, she's fine. We could be married. It would be good. Well, would but, it be a good match for grandfather? Of course. Oh, for grandfather, of course, but for me, oh. never. Wait, uh, what? No. You are engaged and you oh, intend to break okay. it off? I don't intend to break it off if I can find something that I think fits me a bit more. Cousin, you're shopping around? Of course I'm shopping around. You're price comparing? Of course I'm price comparing. I would never just buy. Okay, cousin. <sighs> cousin, I'm married. Oh! 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 Hold on, uh, I'm gonna, uh, Squawk is going to just start knocking down okay. bookshelves and things. Where do we have alcohol? Birds, alcohol. Okay. 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 Cheers. Cheers. What the fuck? Okay. No. <laughs> no. Cousin, cousin, I'm married. Okay. And I have a child. <laughs> and I, and I, and I, Gobble, another. <laughs> Oh, and here's the thing. How it's many okay. children? One, two, three, four, five? Only one, but it's really bad. It's really, really bad. And grandfather's gonna be really pissed if he ever finds Why? out. Because she's on the material plane and I spilled grandfather's secret magic into the material plane. Wait. And she's a mortal manifesting our <laughs> magic. And to keep their secret, I gave away my power of flight. <laughs> Well, I've, wait, so wait, I you hear a bottle it. shatter as Gobble, like, stares at both of you, and then turns and sprints out of the uh, oh. I'm gonna cast, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna cast Otto's Irresistible Dance on uh, uh, Gobble. Okay. Uh, what's he, my save? I, uh, Doesn't matter, it's the natural one. I think, yes, great. Oh my it's God. an 18, I think he just starts dancing. I think <laughs> I, uh, uh, <laughs> He's backing it up. Oh <laughs> Gobble's throwing ass right now. Like, <laughs> please don't. I think Squawk is gonna do like that bird shake of just like, uh, like feathers out, pull it back. Okay. Well. People recommended it to me. Several people have recommended it to me, and I have enjoyed it thoroughly. I heard it's gonna be made into a movie. <laughs> I've heard <laughs> a vicious rumor was spread 
the honor of the goblin court must be maintained. If that rumor originated from Lord Erebus, then of course Lord Erebus could simply publicly retract the statement. However, if the rumor <laughs> did not originate from Lord Erebus, then your honor is perfectly intact as you were misinformed through no wrongdoing of your own. And I would seek counsel with whoever misinformed you. I wish that I could step forward and make my retraction publicly, let everyone know the truth of what happened. So it is another. In that case, I offer this opportunity for the Lords of the Wing to correct my understanding, for indeed, there may be grave consequences to the misdeeds of the individual I now think on. I would hate to think that they might be approached in a brusque manner. If someone else is at fault, I don't know anyone who's been spreading this rumor. I'm just goading this bear. Mm, this <laughs> is your opportunity. Who do you throw under the bus? Oof. I'm going to reach into my, my wings and I'm gonna grab disguises. So they're just like, um, I have a large pair of sunglasses. Mm. I have a scarf um, and I have a wig. I'm just <laughs> scarf, wig, sunglasses, very yes. incognito. I love it. Trying, yeah. It, I still have my wings out. It's fine. Uh, Cousin, <laughs> the new girl, she's at it again. Yes, are those sunglasses? She looks fantastic. I haven't seen anyone wear sunglasses all blue. Uh, well, come in. Yes, I will come in. Hiding my <laughs> voice. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thanks, is that you? No. <laughs> it is it's Charles Foster the second. Yes, come live in my dear, my dear, your <laughs> wings are showing. And I like, <laughs> I feel like we have the same vibe happening, and I want to just him to know that I, he's not going to be murdered. Oh, you like him, like him. Also, you're Gwendolyn. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> I. Kill him. Kill him. Oh, this is a nice hat you have on. Thanks. It's from her. Oh. Yeah. Uh, first of all, yeah. I respect <laughs> your silence on this matter. <laughs> we gotta start killing people in this campaign. <laughs> Guys. So it is expected that you would betray me. So what is the most goblin thing to do? If I expect you to betray me. You play mind games with me? I don't know. Do you play mind games with me? <laughs> You are going to have counsel with Hob yes. at the moment. I, I think that he can help me. With what? With finding information. You know, the thing that we're talking about, like. Of course. But I think that he can help me find information. I know that, like, there's like. Yeah. What are you talking like, about? Yeah, like, okay, but. <laughs> I mean. Is it obvious? I, so I watch a lot oh. and I've noticed a lot. I will hear the sounds you're making and I will nod empathetically at those sounds so you feel heard and understood. Well, that comforted me very little. You're <laughs> 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 uh, welcome. Uh, uh, Lords of the Wing. <laughs> oh! Ah, and here, uh, no, don't come too close. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 cousin, just grab of what he's wearing, I can't away. possibly. Oh, he's hold wearing. With my oh, own. What is Aunt Hera wearing? Gin. We, oh, we're out of vodka. We just have gin. I will have a. <laughs> or tea, of course. Okay, tea. Vodka Do you have any um, apple juice? <laughs> <It's> just, <laughs> I'll, I'm, I'm, I'm going to leave the two of you. Juice. I'll go see if I can. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'm going to leave the two of you. I'm going to see if I can scrounge up some apple juice. It's deep. It's deep underneath the nest, so I may not be back in a second. Goodbye! I met. Before you say anything. Yes. I cast Zone of Truth. Oh! oh, oh what is it? Uh, Christmas 13. <laughs> Save. How do I put this? Um, I've written checks my body can't quite cash. <laughs> my head could God, spin around. So, <laughs> so, you. so visceral and visual. I like you very much, but sort of in like a babysitter kind of way. Babysitter! <laughs> the energy of it. And I feel so guilty about this. Maybe I'm confused, actually. Uh, I'll just ask you point blank. Are you in love? <gasps> Deeply. <gasps> shit! Oh, shit! <laughs> I knew it! Who wants apple 
juice. <laughs> we had one more case. Ooh. Guilt is not going to serve you in your quest. It is not with you. Oh, oh. Shoot. the guilt is not with me. I ain't, wait, hold on, wait. What it the is, fuck? I am not in love with you. Oh, sh oh, oh. Yes. <gasps> Since the zone of truth, is it all right if I call you auntie and uncle? Dispel magic. <laughs> <laughs> I need to get out of this yes. situation. Okay. If you need a beard to cover up for anything, not a beard. <laughs> feel free. I don't understand that yes, word. Yes, I also am <laughs> very confused. A beard? <laughs> yes. Great. Uncle, auntie, sorry, not that. Again, if you are going yeah. to propose being my beard, don't call me auntie. <laughs> yes, you know, I'm sorry, that makes it if, so if strange, there ever doesn't a it? World yes, maybe, maybe a bit of high octane mm. excitement from the Lords of the Wing. Maybe it's really? just what this bloom needs. Mm. You've else? given us much to think about, Pillar yes. Boy. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we met in the fray of battle. But I believe that our relationship was forged in uh, the quiet serenity of everyday conduct. To maintain one's honor in the face of the trials and tribulations of life is a constant battle. And so in that way, your highness, we have never left the battlefield. Shit, yeah, when you put it that way. <laughs> First of all, I just want to say, as the, like, these dark cloaked, like goblin and unseely, like walk through the shadows, I have a very, I have like a good stealth. We just look hot. I just want it to be known that we're like yeah, walking yeah. across a misty hold on, moor. Hold on, hold on. Perform performance check from both of you. Ooh. Uh, 15. That's high. That's high. Shit. 21. <laughs> <laughs> Why are they so hot right now? You're just walking, you're hot. Hey, yo, boss, you look dope. <laughs> Very good, Scorpio, at ease. He's uh, lays back down. I see Rue here. I like visibly catch my breath in my chest. And Insight check. 13. 16. Oh. They don't clock it. <clears throat> Oh, you absolutely feel that that Hob is uh, uh, feels like painful shame at how enamored he is of Rue, and is it is a very self excoriating. It is a feeling of just like you, you idiot. Like this is never gonna like even in the the swell of feeling, there is like a self reproach. As I absorb those thoughts and those feelings, I find the fairies of the Court of Wonder to be arrogant, vain, haughty, small minded and of a nature most unbecoming to those of us who wish to uphold true values like rumpus and mischief. I knock over Ventorica's dummy <laughs> by accident. I'm just shook by that. Uh, in, uh, I say, I say, as a- This tailor is fucked up. Uh, I, I don't mean to, I understand that some members of that court herein are present, Deloso de la Rue. <laughs> oh! This is so shitty. Scorpio knows everything. <laughs> The Viscountess Grabalba's honor will be avenged! Can I please be out of here? Yeah, I'm sorry. Thank you. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> it was yelling off in the distance. <laughs> Taylor's in the middle of fucking nowhere. And my victories were used to, to begin a suitorship with the Prince Apollo and the Viscountess Grabalba, though I will deny it if it is said in public. When that was called off, our opportunity was lost. And we have been looking for the person who was at cause to cancel that engagement. If either of you know who that was, and if it is not Prince Apollo, we will seek satisfaction from who actually did us wrong. But of course, the possibility remains that it was not one person and that the entire affair was a charade from the beginning and was never meant to be an honest engagement. Yes, anyway, great fight. <laughs> the K in KP stands for Nicholas. <laughs> what? <laughs> the K in KP stands for Nicholas. At that, at, honestly, at that moment, <laughs> Rue's whole <laughs> exterior completely shatters, takes a huge sigh. <sighs> And very clearly, <laughs> surface level thought, I love him. <laughs> <laughs>